Hello and welcome back everyone. Today I'm actually excited to share with you guys a book I've enjoyed and recommended to all of my engineering friends by now. And it's called The Theoretical Minimum, written by Leonard Susskind. For those of you who don't know, I would liken Leonard Susskind to a modern day Richard Feynman. He's one of the founders of string theory and has written multiple books about black holes, general relativity, and quantum mechanics. This book I'm holding here today is definitely fast paced, so having taken a cause level physics course and calculus course is definitely going to help. Like the book suggests, it's the theoretical minimum, and underneath the title it actually says everything you need to know to start doing physics. And I would agree. It goes over so many things from simple systems using the toss of a coin, all the way into particles and path integrals. Here today, I'm just going to give a quick breakdown of the book. So the first two chapters give you a reminder of coordinate systems, functions, trigonometry, and basic vector math. Then the book talks about motion, where he covers differentiation and rules like the product and chain rule. Then it goes into introductory vector calculus, and next we jump into a quick review of integral calculus and talk about integration. Next, the theoretical minimum dives into Newton's laws of motion and partial differentiation. After that, we brush up on force, potential energy, and the principle of least action, and what it has to do with the Lagrangian of a system. This eventually brings us to the Euler-Lagrange equation, which is a great segue into symmetries and conservation laws. Symmetries are crucial to the understanding of fundamental physics and the book gives us a good understanding of Lagrangian and Hamiltonian mechanics. Then the book wraps up with a few final chapters on more advanced calculus ideas like flow and divergence as well as angular momentum and an introduction to electromagnetism. This book is definitely more of a review or guideline than anything but it's a fantastic way to brush up on well everything you need to know to start doing physics. The book is lighthearted and in my opinion really well structured, if a bit hand wavy at times. Let me know in the comments what your thoughts are or if there's any other book or content you'd like me to cover. As always, if you liked this video, please don't forget to leave a like and if you hated it, don't forget to share with someone you hate.